So I actually feel like I've been following you for like ever. Do you actually remember how it all happened? I think. Yeah, yes. yeah. I <laughs> Remind me. You had posted a picture of yourself on the beach, and I remember I wrote a woman truly walking her talk. Thank you. You can come visit me anytime <laughs> you like. <laughs> I'll be there. So sweat and oranges. I mean, um, you both sort of own one owns the food, one owns the physical, but obviously you both practiced both of them. Healthy as a way of life is really our motto, and. I think that incorporates for us our family and spending time with the people that we love and having good relationships and uh, that's really important to us. I really like to train hard. And I've seen that. Yes, I like to train hard and I, um, and I like to eat well, but Katie's more passionate about food than she is about training really hard. So tell us about the oranges. Yes. <laughs> so I am food. Um, I think for me, I've been so interested in nutrition um, and food. I was a beauty therapist in my past life uh, and I sort of really wanted to help people that extra step and I knew internally is where we had to do it. So I went and studied nutrition um, for the last four years and I've now finished and I guess I just I love the idea of how food can heal you. It can change the way that you feel when you wake up in the morning and how you work out and how hard you can work out. So it's really the great combination. So if people follow you on Instagram, it's like they're getting the best of both worlds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. And I think they can see that both of us are still interested in the other though. So it's mm. um, it's not just one, you know, you need them both. I know, Bobby. Oh, yeah, <laughs> so beautiful. She's so gorgeous. Thank you. Well done. And you're going to eat you. green smoothies. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Thank you so much for sharing your smoothie recipe with me because every girl needs just one more smoothie recipe. They do. We, yes. we feel like we know all of them, but I there's know. always one they secret do. ingredient. Should we yes. get started? Yes, okay. let's go. Tell me what to do. So I want to show you my favourite breakfast smoothie. Mm -hmm. So coming into summer, I love smoothies for breakfast, um, but you need to make sure you get all the right components. Um, we don't want to be hungry in an hour's time. So let's start with a banana. Just one? Yes, we'll do one banana. So we've got some potassium in there, some energy, and that'll give us a bit of sweetness. Some berries. Okay. So lots of vitamin C in there, good for our skin and our immune okay. system. Uh, let's put a little bit of cacao, so some raw cacao, which is give you a nice chocolatey edge. Teaspoon? Which, yes, let's do a teaspoon. Yum, yum, yum. Yes, you can have chocolate for breakfast. Let's do a scoop of protein powder. Okay, yeah. one scoop some chia seeds, a little bit of protein in there too, but lots of good fats mm -hmm. and omega-3. And we'll do a tablespoon of flaxseed as well, a bit similar to chia seeds. Um, that's gonna feed your good bacteria in your gut. And then let's put some coconut oil. Love a bit of coconut oil. Which is beautiful. And let's finish off with some coconut water. And we'll do it cocktail style. Yes, Ooh, absolutely. Two at a time. That smells delicious. And let's put the... Ready to go? Yes. Okay. Let's see how it'll turn out. We'll make some noise, put it right on. Okay. You think? That sounds yep. good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Oh, it looks delicious. And no smoothie is complete if it's not in a jar. Exactly, and a straw. I gave you the pink one. We must yes. be, you must be my best friend. Cheers. Mm, it's amazing. Delicious. Now let's sit down and enjoy Good. it. So Jane, you've promised me life-changing exercises. Why are these exercises so important? Okay, well our first one I'm gonna show you is called a Renegade Row. And why I love the Renegade Row is it works on our back and it does really engage our core. So we're not just working our back, we're also working on that favourite bit that we all love to Fantastic. work on. Fantastic. Okay, so what I want you to make sure is that your hands are right underneath your chest, under your armpits, okay? Mm -hmm. From your knees, you're just gonna squeeze up. And keeping your neck in, in neutral, so making sure you're not dipping down and not looking up like that. Or we can come up onto our toes, lock them in tight, keep your feet shoulder width apart, and that's gonna really activate that core. Nice and strong exercise. Okay, give okay. it a go. All right, and we'll do eight, and then we'll go up onto our toes. So, so coming right out, that's it. So squeeze. So oh, really, it is hard to say still. Yeah, so yeah. take your feet a little bit wider, and we're gonna squeeze, and, Really try and pull your shoulder blade up. Really squeeze up through, that's it. And really bring that 
elbow right up to the sky. <laughs> and really work that back and really squeeze in through your core. You rest for about 30 seconds and do three sets. That was great. Is that good? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay, number two exercise is going to use your whole body and using my favourite piece of gym kit, the kettlebell. I love a kettlebell. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to do a squat into a row, then back down into a push-up. Okay. okay, lots to think about. Walking out, push-up. Beautiful. Bend the knees, bend the knees, bend the knees. You're using your core, you're using your chest. There's nothing we're missing out. Yeah. <laughs> Efficient exercising, it's called. Really nice. It feels great. Yeah, it? yeah, using your whole body, aren't you? Not one part's missing out. Last one. Push up. <laughs> I back think up I again. took my hands out too far. And then back. So bend those legs. Squat down. Up nice and high. Good. Use those shoulders. Good. Well done. Fantastic. <laughs> that was amazing. Thank you. No worries. Thank you. Woo!